Welcome to the channel and the truck and logistics simulator. Uh, I was a bit dubious about getting this. Came out on the 30th of November, I think it's the 19th of December now. Uh, been really busy still, still redoing the whole house. I had much chance to do anything else, but uh, I did wait off on this because uh, I saw a truck driver. The new truck driver came out. It did have wheel support with it and all that. Like, and it's like, do you know what? I'm done with it. Um, but this one here, I've seen a few good reviews about it. Uh, basically, just on the Xbox Store, people were liking it. They're saying there's no real um, career or anything to do with it. Just things you've got to do, which is fine. And there is multiplayer. I've not tried it yet. Um, I've literally just downloaded it. I've had a mess around. Um, Briefly on my other profile where I downloaded it to uh, I'm just gonna have a quick look at it now just to uh, see what uh, well let you know what I think of it um, And also let me know in the comments what you're thinking of this too. I'm gonna go single player I'm just gonna have a quick look through of what we can do now. I am actually using my controller um, I'm gonna try next time if I can do another video on this I'm gonna see if I can get my wheel out uh, and put it down I said I'm living in a building site at the moment, which is a bloody nightmare uh, so we can purchase all these and what have you. I have turned the music down, uh, so I don't know if there's any copyright music to it, but you can pick your different cars here. So uh, what can we do? Oh, only that one we can test drive. We can't test drive that one. So um, I'm not too bothered about the car right now. I don't want to pick up. We've got a minivan. What other vans we got there? Oh, we can test drive that. Panel van. We can only test drive this one here. We've got the drop side, which we can test drive. We've got the two different vehicles there. We've got a rigid truck. Uh, by the look of it, we can't test drive that one. The truck there, we can test drive this. Yeah, we can test drive that one. And we've got a, <laughs> a monster truck. Uh, and we can't test drive that. So uh, I just want to see what it's like properly. Um, I do think the brief moment of this is all I've done on it is just on the test drives that I've uh, the brief moment I've messed around on it they have learned I think a lot from on the road um, because they really did mess up I really do think so so uh, what I'm going to do I'm going to take this little minivan here and I'm going to take it for a test drive now we've got to purchase it just for a test drive on there but we can do other things as well uh, what's this one here? Forklift. I used to drive forklift. I'm a licensed forklift driver as well, so I'm going to have a go at that there and just see what it's like. And we've got an achievement come up. Try before you buy. Well, you've got your indicator axes and all this blah 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 mirrors. And I think there was a uh, uh, there was an internal view and an external view for the vehicles. I don't know if there was on the forklift. I'm assuming there is on all the vehicles you've got. Please don't tell me it's froze. Ah, here we go. Well, hey, we've got an inside view as well. So that's really cool. So we'll lift the uh, forks up and down. And we've got to pick that pallet up and stick it in the back of that van. So I'm going to see if we can do this. I'm going to start the engine first. Let's see if we can do this. I don't know if we can uh, change the seating view on this position I mean. Uh, can we get in there now? Whoa, 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 that's too high. <laughs> oh, we have got lights. Is that low enough now? No, a little bit more. Right, let's get this lifted up and put in the van. Oh, this might be a bit of fun. Can we change the the viewing angle in here, I think we can. The sensitivity, I think, I'm going to turn that down a little bit more. Because um, it is a bit a bit sharp when you're using the controller. I said I've not tried it on the um, wheel yet. Leave that as it is for now for the traffic and the multiplayer density. Or density. Uh, field of view, I'm going to up the field of view a bit more. I'm going to... Well, that's maximum, 75. That is seating position. So we can go up, we can go down, 
and let's sit back just a little bit from there right let's try that and see what that does and there's our map uh what is it no that's for the right right hand thumbstick to move it around and mini map zoom ah right now someone said the maps aren't that big which it doesn't look that big but if you're playing it properly and sticking to the speed limits then i don't think there'll be much of a problem with it and considering they seem to have got this one right well in my opinion at the moment let's just see because it's not crashed on me or anything yet uh it seems they've learned a lot right then stop there let's, oh, let's, just, let's get that out there we go we're done oh that's the only thing you don't i, I wish you could do on the uh, like you did on on the road and that i wish you could get out but you can't right so there's our van we're in now and we've got to follow that marker to where we're going i want to go on the inside view and again i have a funny feeling we're gonna to have to move blimey we're sat right up against the bloody dashboard so uh where are we go to options and seating position let's come back Let's come back just a little bit more. Uh, yeah, let's just leave it like that for now. Right, so when you start the vehicle, now press down on the right thumbstick was to centre your view, and then left thumbstick, pressing down on that, you've got your mirrors. If you want the extra ones, I'm going to see if I'm going to use those for now. You can look right round as well in here, which I quite like, and they've actually still got this thing where you can look round the outside as well press down on the uh, right thumbstick to get it back to central. Right, uh, we need to go. The only thing with this, using the controller, I find it's a little bit, 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 bit jerky. The acceleration of that is a little bit much. Uh, so where are we going? We want to go, no, where are we going? Oh, we want to go a bit further out, yeah. Oh, speed bumps. Yeah, it's just getting used to the driving, I think, at the moment. You can go and get fuel as well, and you can repair your vehicle. So let's just go in here, see about getting and get fuel. Right, we'll turn the engine off and we're refueling. 45 is the maximum we can hold. We've done that. I think we can repair our vehicle as well if it's needed. Uh, I'm a shoot. No, that's a pizza place. Where do you repair it? Ah, around the other side. There is a garage that you go in and do that. Right, let's go back in. See what I mean about this? The acceleration and this. Whoa! Sorry, dude. That is so my fault. <laughs> and that. Oh my god. Right, where are we going? I think. Are we going up here? I think we've just gone the wrong bloody way. I'm not even, I'm looking at the sat nav, I'm not even looking where we're going. Right, uh, yeah, we want to come back. I think we want to go down here. We've got a 50 mile an hour speed limit. I oh, know we want to, I should have stopped there. Right, we want to go back up on this highway. I've seen it in the mirrors. Mirrors seem to be working all right. I know it's they do kind of just disappear in the uh, rear view mirror. Let's set the camera. I don't know what the speed limit is on here. But so far, I'm quite liking it. It's not brilliant, the graphics, but. It's good enough for me at the moment, it's working. So where are we going here? We're going left. What's that? X button, blue button for the horn. Back inside, I think Y. Yeah, Y for the wiper blades. Left and right on the thumb pad, which are indicators. 
I think you've got something connected. I think B is the action button, the red button. I think that is the actual uh, thing attached and detached trailers and stuff. Park the, the parking space. Where the hell have I gone? I've just gone way past where I should have been by the look of it. Too busy messing around on here. Uh, I'm not supposed to do this. Give me handbrake. Whoa! <laughs> I didn't realise you could handbrake on this. Right. So we lost our our sat sat nav point now, have we? This has come out of it. It's telling us to go that way. She's over there. So how do we get round there? I thought it might put back the. Uh, we've got a red light. I thought it might put back our waypoint on our sat nav. Uh, wait in now. These lights to change. So do you see on the map you've got a filling, filling station and a spanner. Spanners for your repairs by the look of it. And I cannot get used to this steering. Wow. I'm hoping it'd be better with the wheel. It's supposed to have wheel support. I don't know. Right, we're going. Yeah, right, let's, let's, let's just be really careful on the acceleration. Right, so we've got to go over here. Look, there's an auto repair there. So have we got to reverse it there? Well, I don't know if we should reverse it because you want bit Oh, the donuts. I want some donuts. Well, I didn't realise there's a little reversing camera on your dash as well. Right, let's just stop in here. That's where we've got to go. Oh, that's it, we don't even have to unload it. Clean drive, really? I thought I had an accident. So we've got 43 XP on that. 300 in cash, but uh, yeah, minus 61, because we filled up with some fuel as well. 239 in cash, 43 XP. We've got 12177. Right, that's the minivan. That's probably not going to be much different. We can test drive these. Let's have a look at the uh, test drive in this one. Uh, what should we do on this? Oh, shall we deliver this here? Yeah, let's deliver this. Come on. Loading screens ain't that bad, I don't think. He says. Oh, did I just have to press the A button? Right, we've got to get over there, so we're going to have to lift this up. Uh, oh, that place will tilt on that as well. Right, let's just get this over here. Oh, what a view. Can we get this on? <laughs> Am I on? Oh, I've gone too far. Let's go back a bit. Right. Oh, it does it all for you. Right, now we're in the van. Uh, where are we? Oh, there it is there, so... Put on. That hasn't. Oh, there's our light. Wipers. So up on the th uh, thumb pads, your lights. Down's your hazards. Left and right's your indicators. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't know you had hazards on here. That's quite cool. Right, uh, let me just start us up. Attach the trailer. Yeah, so far I am quite liking it. It's a shame there's no like story thing to do, but does it really matter? Right, we're, we're attached and now we have to leave. Where do we have to leave? Which way? Can't get out that way. And now our little thing's gone. 
our marker on our um, map down the bottom there. Now I'm guessing our exit, is it? Uh, I don't know if I should have gone this way. Let's have a look this way. <laughs> we need to get to a road. Oh, are we driving? That's the beach. Uh, I don't know. I don't think we're going to do this. Can we get up here? No, let's just turn around. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. <laughs> Oh dear, what's going on here? Oh, it's too heavy, isn't it? I just want to spin it around here. Right, I, I've obviously come out the wrong way. I'm just hoping, like I said, the... Um, the acceleration is easier, a bit better, a bit more controllable with the wheel. Right, I don't think I should have gone out of there, should I? I must have to go out over here. Is this an exit? Yes, it is. Cool. Right. Now I'm assuming we're going to go right here. Ah, oh, we've got a map thing back on now. Go right here. Yeah, let me know in the comments if you've already got the game and been playing it. What are you thinking about it so far? Are you liking this? So far, I, I'm, I'm more hopeful with this than what they've done with. Uh, what did I hit? The, I hit the bloody barrier. I hate using controllers to do these games now. Yeah, well, from, from on the road, I, I, I don't know what, they just completely hash that up, I think. And I have played that for ages. Um, this, if you just like just driving around, I think it's quite cool at the moment. And especially if you can get other things. And plus there's online as well, there's multiplayer now. I did see on one of the reviews or the comments on uh, the Microsoft Store that um, oh, should I carry on? Yeah, carry on. Um, they're saying that it's, it's great to play with your friends online and what have you, but they, it's not synced the same, so you're not seeing what your friends are seeing, which it would be good if they could do that. I don't see the point otherwise, if I've got an online multiplayer and if you can help each other out and you're not seeing the same thing, I don't see the point in that. Am I, going the, I think I'm going the right way. I do like as well how you've got weight on these as well. It slows the vehicle down. Still in the tank, to turn that off. Now, am I coming off here? I think I'm going off this way. So I'm finding it really difficult with the uh, controller to steer. Straight on. I wonder, can you? Is there a way of the steering? Let's turn the steering down a little bit more. Let's turn it right down to there. I don't think there's anything you can do. The acceleration is a bit annoying. Well, over that side, we can't get used to driving on the uh, right hand side. <laughs> but so far, I think this is quite cool. I said just for a test drive, I don't know what the actual game's like right now. And I do believe. You can get down for speed because you said you can turn your fines and that off if you want. But when I was messing earlier on, I 
do recall seeing a little speed camera van sat at the side of the road which was quite good I think they got fixed cameras as well you can't turn the um, uh, I think we're coming off here you can't turn the little map off on the left hand side which I hope they change at some point if you just want to use your little sat nav, I know it's a little bit awkward. To sit. Whoa! I didn't even see him coming out. <laughs> That's my fault. Uh, I don't even know where we're going now. I think should we return? So I, no, I think we've got to go straight on because there's a garage there, filling station there, and we've got a we've got a green light. I think we've got to turn right here. Gonna turn right at these lights here once they've changed. There we go. Back outside again for a little bit. We're almost here now actually. Does it actually show damage? I don't know if it does. I don't know if it shows visual damage where I just someone just hit me when I pulled out in front of them or what, but I think you, you have got damage. Uh, I think we're turning right here. Oh, right, yeah, my steering, I might have turned that down a little bit too much. Might have to alter that in a bit. Depends on the speed. Right, we want to go over there by the look of it, so we're here. back in. Oh, we've got to go, I'm just over there. Uh, I don't know if I've got to reverse that in. I think you can change the time as well. Hold on, what are we on? We're on dynamic. System time, paused, dynamic. Uh, let's go on system time. Because it is daylight, it's like 20 past 3 in the afternoon for me. So we can look around inside. We do like that. We've still got our mirrors. Alright, just see when we get this. Uh, where have we got to park it? Over there. Where's our trailer? Right, I can see the trailer now. Get our arse end over here a bit more. Oh, I've made a balls of that. <laughs> We're going well out of the way. Right. Let's get this just parked up. And I, I'm not going to start playing this game properly until I get the wheel sorted out, I get the wheel out, which I'll, I'll try and get that down and put up in the next day or so. But at the moment as well, as like I said, I'm doing the house. I'm, I'm, I'm oh, bloody owl. And I'm, I'm working two jobs still at the moment, so I've been a bit busy, obviously, with Christmas coming. Been a bit of a nightmare. I'm planning after Christmas, I should be just doing one job. I think I'm going to do my driving job I got last year, Jack in being self employed. That was going to give me a bit more time to do stuff then. Finish the house and this. Oh, I didn't even have to park it properly. So we must have got damage on there. Parking bonus. Uh, 58 XP it says, 400 cash. Didn't say anything about damage, did it? No. But that's it. And we've got the rigid. And the, uh, we can't test drive that. But anyways... I'm going to leave the video there. I didn't want to take it too long. I mean, it's went on for over 20 minutes. So, uh, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed that. Let me know in the comments. if Did you actually buy the game? Have you been playing it? What do you think of it? So far, just a bit mess around. Only on the um, test driving for all those few vehicles there. I just wanted to see what it was like. I do quite like it. I think they've done a better job on this than they did with On the Road. So, uh, 
Again, if you're new to the channel though, and you're not subscribed, please do. Give the videos a like and a share, much appreciated. Because uh, I haven't really put much videos out lately. I've just been messing around. I was messing around with Red Dead and all that. Like, but like I said, I just haven't had time to do anything. And it's just the fact that I've sat here today and I saw it come up on the store. And I thought, do you know what? I was like, It was on my uh, wish list. But I just didn't bother because it's like, I don't want to go as soon as it comes out. I want to see what it's like after a, three or four weeks. So uh, I took the plunge, bought it. So far, I'm liking it. But uh, next time, I'll get my wheel out and I'll have a bash at that. So uh, thanks again for coming along. And uh, hopefully see you shortly in another video. So take care. Bye-bye.